Hey guys, today I want to teach you how to make a hair tincture which is good for fighting hair loss, fighting dandruff and for a healthy hair growth. Let's get started. So for this tincture we need 10 grams of stinging nettle leaves, 10 grams of birch tree leaves, 10 grams of rosemary leaves, 5 grams of thyme leaves and 5 grams of fenugreek seeds. We also need 200 milliliter of alcohol, which needs to be at least 40% or 80 proof and 50 milliliter of glycerin. So to prepare this tincture, it's really easy. First, you need to put all the herbs into a blender. Then you add the alcohol and the glycerin and then you blend it. blended very very smoothly just roughly to increase the absorption size of the herbs so when it's blended you put it into a mason jar you add the lid and that's about it Now you need to wait two weeks. You need to shake it every day, once or twice, or if you forget it, just every few days once, but it's better to, day, to shake every day. And after two to four weeks, you strain it through a cheesecloth and you can put it into little like uh, spraying bottles and uh, use it. So now how to use our hair tincture? It's again very easy. In the evening before you go to bed, you just take the spray bottle and you Spray the hair tincture directly on the scalp. The best is if you like part the hair strand by strand and then spray it on the scalp. After you have sprayed the tincture on your hair, please massage lightly your scalp so the tincture gets better absorbed. Then you go to bed. And the second day when you get up, you wash your hair with a mild shampoo and you're ready to go. The tincture has a little of a herbal smell. so. If you don't mind it, you can also, in addition to using it in the evening, you can also put it on the second day after washing your hair and after towel drying your hair. If you use it like this, the result will be better. But some people don't like the smell or can't wear any smelly stuff at work or in their daily lives. So the most important thing is to, to use it in the evening. So now why does this little tincture help? Well, stinging nettle is one of the oldest and most used herbs for healthy hair and healthy scalp. It fights hair loss, reduces inflammation and also is said to block DHT in the scalp and thereby fight hair shedding. The other herbs also fight inflammation, fight free radical damage and most importantly they increase blood flow to the scalp and thereby aid in the nourishment of the hair and also the hair growth. Some other advice to keep in mind when you are suffering from hair loss is to also internally take nettle products like for example nettle tea or nettle smoothie and you can check my other tutorials for this. Another thing is to reduce animal protein in the diet, especially from milk and milk products as milk is pro-inflammatory. And a third advice is to try to reduce stress and take care that you sleep well. You can also use some herbal teas which may help you with this. I hope you find this tutorial helpful and I'm looking forward to see you next time.